from SND College of Engineering. Today we have discussed about <coughs> today we have discussed about the point on the hybrid electric vehicles. So, in next, uh, what is a hybrid? Okay, a hybrid vehicle is a vehicle that uses two or more distinct power sources to move the vehicle that is HEV hybrid electrical vehicle such as a vehicle powered by both an electric motor and an internal combustion engine as a source of power for the driven train ok means petrol plus motor is equal to HEV hydraulic electrical sorry hybrid electrical vehicle then next brief history of hybrid a hybrid vehicle that uses two or more distinct power sources to move the vehicle hybrid technology for the use of automobiles has been around since the last 1800s with combination of electric and steam power or electric and combustion engines in 1970s oil crisis brought hybrid prototype in response to high gas prices not very commercial viable in 1997 the Toyota Prius was introduced in Japan and later introduced to the United States in 2000 this was the first commercial mass produced hybrid definition of <coughs> hybrid electrical vehicle is a type of hybrid vehicle and electric vehicle which combines a combination sorry which combines a conventional internal combustion engine propulsion system with an electric propulsion system that is hybrid electric vehicle the most common form of HEV is the hybrid electric car although hybrid electric truck pickups and tractors and buses also exist then introduction to hybrid electrical vehicles a <coughs> vehicle that combines two or more sources of power that can directly or indirectly provide propulsion power is a hybrid a hybrid electrical vehicle is a type of hybrid vehicle and electric vehicle which combines a conventional ICE propulsion system with an electric propulsion system so that is a simple diagram of hybrid electrical vehicle you have to see, uh, you have to see in this diagram the petrol engine is, is used in this and that output sharp power is going to the electric motor generator first and that is going on inverter then fuel cell then fuel cell to inverter 2 right then fuel cell is uh, to the uh, down converter then battery right then auxiliary devices okay that is for uses for the auxiliary devices then the inverter 2 is used to the uh, for the running the uh, electric motor generator 2 and that electric gen motor generator 2 is rotate the power split gears right and that power split gears is rotate the differential of your wheels that is a simple working of hybrid electrical vehicle you have to discuss on this so uh, key component of hybrid electric car that is battery in an electric drive vehicle the low voltage auxiliary battery provides electricity to start the car before the traction battery is engaged it also power vehicle accessories then DC DC AC DC converter this device converts higher sorry DC DC converters uh, this device converts 
higher voltage dc power from the traction battery back to the lower voltage dc power needed to run vehicle accessories and recharge the auxiliary battery okay so next part is electric generator generates electricity from the rotating wheels while braking transferring that energy back to the traction battery pack some vehicles use motors motor generators that perform both the drive and generation function electric traction motor using power from the traction battery packs this motor drives the vehicle's wheels some vehicles use motor generators that perform both the drives and generation functions then next component is exhaust system the exhaust system channels the exhaust gases from the engine out through the tailpipe a three way catalyst is designed to reduce engine out emission within the exhaust system then next component is fuel filter fuel filler sorry a nozzle from a fuel dispenser attaches to the receptacle on the vehicle to fill the tank fuel tank this tank stores gasoline on a board the vehicle until it's needed by the engine then next component is internal combustion engine in this configuration fuel is injected into either the intake manifold or the combustion chamber where it is combined with the air and the air fuel mixture is ignited by the spark from a spark plug power electronics controller this unit manages the flow of electrical energy delivered by the traction battery controlling the speed of the electric traction motor and the torque is product produces thermal system this system maintain a proper operating temperature range of the engine electric motor power electronics and other components the next component is traction battery pack stores electricity for use by the electric traction motor then last is transmission the transmission tr transfer mechanical power from the engine and the or electric traction motor to the drive the wheels so how hydraulic sorry how hybrid electric vehicle basically works during the starting position none of the system is working after the car starts to move it is in the normal driving mode thus the car will automatically change to the use of electric motor later when the car is accelerated and gained speed it switches from the use of motor to the use of engine thus the gasoline engine supplies the required power this switching is carried out automatically with the help of an on board computer since the battery has lost some of its charge it needs to be immediately recharged this is also done automatically when the car starts to go in the uniform speed or when it is descending a road the generator starts charging the battery so the next point is types of hybrid electric vehicles there are three main types of hybrid electric vehicles that is full hybrid then mild hybrid and plug in hybrid a full hybrid can run on just a combustion engine the electric engine 
or a combination the toyota prius is the most commonly known example of this a full hybrid is not plugged in to recharge the battery is recharged by running the combustion engine okay that is simple full hybrid then a mild hybrid has an electric motor and combustion engine which always works together an example of this is the honda accord hybrid mild hybrid cannot run in just electric or just combustion engine mode the engine motor engine motors always works in par parallel okay so that is simple mild hy hybrid then plug in hybrid as the name suggest requires plugging into the main in order to fully recharge its battery <clears throat> plug in hybrid electric vehicles can be run in just electric mode a mild hybrid has an electric and combination combustion engine which always works together an example of honda accord okay so there is a simple types of uh, hybrid electrical vehicles there are three main types of vehicles that is uh, full full uh, full uh, full electrics then mild hybrid sorry full hybrid mild hybrid and uh, plug in hybrid okay then uh, what are the uh, advantage and disadvantages of hybrid electric vehicle advantages no gas required no emission cost effective low maintenance pay back period low noise that is advantages then key advantages of hybrid electrical vehicles that is optimize the fuel economy optimize the operating point of ic engine stop the ic engine if not needed recover the kinetic energy at braking reduce the size of ic engine reduce emission minimize the emission when ic engine is optimized in operation stop the ic engine when it's not needed reduce size of ic engine means less emission okay thank you that is the end of our lecture next time we have discuss about next topic